so now we will continue with the uh, uh, we will basically uh, be returning to uh, towards the uh, variable uh, speed operation variable speed operation of a wind turbine so uh, maximum uh, rotor efficiency corresponds to the value of the tip speed ratio for a certain wind turbine the turbine must uh, run uh, at uh, low speed in uh, low winds and at high speeds in high winds uh, it is basic an anomaly and we cannot change it so uh, uh, um, one must ensure to maintain a constant uh, tsr uh, ratio uh, this is uh, basically done uh, to maintain the uh, cp uh, that's the uh, rotor efficiency that is uh, uh, that is it must be uh, maintained uh, close to zero point uh, five. So, the pitch control acts by pitching the blades in or out uh, of the wind uh, to keep the uh, tip speed ratio at a constant uh, balance or the uh, power at a maximum uh, point. It basically uh, depends upon the mode of control that we are using. Uh, to control the uh, maximum power operation uh, in cases of uh, variable wind operation so basically there there are two uh, modes of operation uh, the uh, the first uh, uh, mode of operation is the stall control it uses aerodynamic stall to regulate the output of the high wind speed and the second one is the pitch control so uh, this uh, is the uh, curve of uh, uh, the efficiency uh, this is the efficiency rotor efficiency plot if uh, no mecha mechanism of con uh, controlling uh, the rotor efficiency has been uh, applied uh, for instance in this curve the dotted curve uh, this is a curve with a uh, rotor efficiency of uh, constant values and uh, when it has not been increased or decreased with respect to the uh, wind speed so uh, the efficiency is uh, lower however if we uh, are using a certain control mechanism to increase the overall efficiency then the generator power limit will be increased with respect to uh, wind speed uh, this is the uh, 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 second cup and this has been uh, plotted for the two types of uh, control mechanism the first one is the this is a stall uh, control and this one uh, is the, the solid line indicates the pitch uh, control so the st uh, stall regulated uh, stall regulated uh, supply of or control scheme uh, is uh, the dotted line so which indicates uh, that the area under the curve is significantly improved but uh, uh, in uh, pitch uh, regulated uh, type of control the curve is relatively uh, smoother in uh, these areas uh, the overall efficiency of uh, the uh, stall regulated uh, scheme is relatively high as compared to the pitch regulated scheme but uh, the uh, on the other hand uh, in these areas from a uh, 15 uh, to onwards let's say it is 18 uh, meter per second wind to onward 25 meter per second wind uh, the overall efficiency of pitch regulated the controller uh, scheme is uh, greater as compared to the uh, stall uh, regulated control scheme so uh, these are the smoother curves uh, where as these are the actual curves as we know that the wind uh, speed is uh, not steady and it is fluctuates uh, a lot so the actual uh, curves uh, will be looking like this and this and they will not be uh, smoother